My name is Jesus Serrano, and I work uh, for the uh, Research and Development uh, Department for Jose Andres Group. And we just create whatever comes to our mind. It's like Jose say, we first cook in our mind, and then we put in practice. Today I'm working a really cool dessert for a very special client that we have. It's basically it's gonna be a chocolate golf ball. Yesterday I mixed some silicone in a liquid state with the activator, and I pour into a mold uh, that contained two golf balls. And basically just pour this all over uh, the golf balls. So you let it sit overnight. This is actually nice. That's the definition I was looking for. Adding the cream just, it's gonna make it more like airy, fluffy, smooth. All right. We have the molds, we have the mousse. Now let's get the, uh, the cherry from the freezer. All right. So these are the molds, the spheres that we did yesterday. They came out pretty nice. And that's what we're gonna be uh, putting inside of the golf ball. So this is a little tricky. So we have to go fast with this. Make sure that the spheres are not melting. Let's see if I can pop one of these out. Yep, here it is. And then let's gentle press to the middle. They get soft really fast. This is gonna look like exactly like a golf ball. Moose around, right in the middle, the uh, cherry sphere. We have to let this set uh, like, I will say 12 hour minimum. Open it and we'll see what we get. All right, here we had this uh, nice chocolate golf ball. Here, uh, this is another important thing, uh, liquid nitrogen. In this nice uh, kind of gigantic golf ball bowl. So the liquid nitrogen is gonna help me uh, to keep the bowl, uh, the mousse like frozen uh, when I dip it here. Because if, if I start losing temperature here, and then I add it to the uh, white chocolate, since the white chocolate is uh, a little warm, it's gonna start kind of melting my, uh, my mousse. So let's start it here. Look like Epcot kind of thing. That's what we we're looking for. So right there, liquid nitrogen to freeze this a little bit. This is a mixture of white chocolate, cocoa butter, white food coloring to light a little bit the, the, the color of the white chocolate. Jose, he's a storyteller. So he normally come with this story and we are like, okay, so let's create something special with that story and put it in a place for the guests. The whole experience starts here, because at the end we, we have to think, if I create this, does the guest is gonna enjoy that? That they're gonna be mind blowing. That they're gonna be transported back to their childhood. You know, you, you you have to think about all that kind of stuff. It's not like putting something on a plate and that's it. Everything has to have a story. So now this can just go back to the uh, fridge, and we'll see it tomorrow. Hopefully, we can print some logo on the ball. Right. So now that we have all the components for the. Uh, the dessert that we just call like Holy One uh, for this special event. Uh, it's time to put it all together. Starting with the chocolate uh, Rice crispy Crunch. Next, the golf ball. Uh, basically the mousse encapsulating white chocolate. We have Lusardo cherries, uh, vanilla chocolate pastry cream, cherry syrup. For the grass of the golf course, I just put some of this uh, sweet peas on the freeze dryer machine. It's gonna go well with the chocolate. Uh, but the most important thing was the color, to have that nice green bright color to make like the, the golf course. And our base here is, is going to be this chocolate sponge cake. Basically the freeze dryer what it does is dry everything, you know, remove the liquid from, the, from any product. Basically freeze the whole liquid inside and then poof, to gas. So that's why all, all the flavor is more concentrated, it's, it's way better. And then you blitz it and it's just powder. 
I'm gonna start with this guy. So what I'm gonna do is small circle heel, and then we're gonna spread that out. And now we dust it. Sponge cake, the bottom. And now we're gonna make this like really moist with this uh, cherry syrup. This is the uh, vanilla and chocolate pastry cream. Now we're gonna cover this a little bit, few pieces of uh, cherries. And now we're gonna, that's go on top. So there it is. So we have a portable edible ink printer. We can get any logo, any picture, and then be able to print it. And it's actually edible. So here we put a little logo on. We'll show you right now. Yeah. Now uh, we'll try. This is a uh, Sergio Garcia's personal chef. I will do more oh, syrup. I will Come do more. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I was expecting more. I will say more definition in the in the golf ball, but with some improvement here and there on the plating, maybe changing plates, having this kind of in a, I would say in a deeper bowl, so you can basically kind of hide all the components under the crispy. For a first try, yeah, it's good. 